It's time for Click and Stick. <laughs> This first click and stick is a website called Yearbook Yourself. It's made by Jostens. You know Jostens. They make the yearbooks, the class rings. Well, they've collected classic yearbook photos from the last six decades, and you can put your own picture inside of them to yearbook yourself. Here's some of my best shots. <laughs> you know, in the 60s, I had the cat glasses. 64, I had to rock the booth, you know? The booth was great. You know, I, I was a go-getter, no bra. <laughs> Still no bra. It was 76, I burned it. 86, I regretted that. <laughs> oh, man. That was Janet Jackson time. I had to get the full extensions. <laughs> now, I don't know. As my man John Hinton says, Nothing ain't right, but some ain't wrong. Or, <laughs> Nothing ain't wrong, but some ain't right. Something like that. Well, I think I could rock all those looks. I kind of, maybe not. Maybe I should leave some of those right where they were. I kind of dig the 70s one with the glasses and the straight hair. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I'm on a college campus and I'm conquering the world. The next click and stick video, I could not stop watching. This guy is the most incredible dishwasher ever. Take a look. <laughs> Wow. Oh! I mean, what? <laughs> what? Hey, you know, I think you missed the spot. Come, come to think of it, you probably missed several spots. That's a great skill, but I'm not eating at that restaurant. <laughs> Uh-oh, we probably already have eaten at that restaurant. <laughs> All right, this next clicking stick blew my mind. A British artist named Kyle Lambert used an iPad app to finger paint an unbelievable portrait. Take a look at this. He spent over 200 hours painstakingly painting this gorgeous piece of art. His digital finger painting was inspired by a Scott Grise photo of Morgan Freeman, who is on the show today, by the way. <laughs> this with my own eyes, I don't think I would have believed it. I'm still not sure that I believe that. You know what? I want to ask Morgan Freeman if, if he thinks it's real when it gets out here. How about that? Yeah! All right. Now listen, I'm a sucker for a quiz. So the last click and stick is a website called HelloQuizzy.com. HelloQuizzy has thousands of quizzes like the Star Wars personality test or which Muppet are you test, or what is your spirit animal test? I was always curious to find out what my spirit animal was, so here it is. Drum roll, please. My spirit animal was a deer. <laughs> your spirit animal is the deer. They are respectable and beautiful animals. They are fearful and timid at times and are considered as having only slightly above average nobility and wisdom. <laughs> What? <laughs> oh, no. Now, I'm wise enough to know that that test is wrong. <laughs> My spirit animal is way better than a deer. So, I, you know, I thought I must have done something wrong. So I took the quiz again. And this is what my real spirit animal was. Yeah! yeah. my spirit animal. <laughs> Nobody tell me I'm just a deer. <laughs> and that's Click and Stick. <laughs>